Okay, so we're doing a little bit of motor pacing and a 20 minute progressive interval, so it's how today goes. Yeah, Oscar, ¿qué tal? ¿Todo bien? <laughs> ¿Todo bien? ¿Las Ulti piernas? Último bien? entrenamiento, no, me duele mucho. Uh, mañana va en vuelo para Mallorca. Mañana viene a Mallorca y jueves comienza la challenge. Ah, vale, vale. Mucha suerte, yo va en vacaciones. Ahora en Dutchess, en Dutchess. All good for today's training? Yeah. Last good training before the season starts. Yep. So the other guys are heading off for a bit of motor pacing and I'm going to a climb do some 20 minute progressive intervals because um, I have to be back at the top I really give my bike to the mechanics because we're heading off to Palma de Mallorca tomorrow so yeah we all do a little bit of different training I'm focusing more on improving my threshold a little bit as opposed to just leg speed um, it's a long story which I don't have time to explain now in regards of that training but staying on the coaches program as well um, we are fortunate enough here to sometimes do our own thing so that's pretty cool um, that we're able to follow coaches plans now and then um, that's really lenient of the team Just a quick story this morning. Earlier morning for us this morning in training and uh, kind of woke up, not late, but on time schedule. So I had to have breakfast quite quick. And uh, basically <laughs> forgot to really take a water bottle or anything. So I had like an empty bottle left on my bike. I had to quickly, as I was going into the mountains, doing some different intervals as a, some of the groups, I kind of had a limit of, you had to buy more than two euros to pay with a card. I always carry a card in the back of my phone. So I had a bike packet of Haribos. Always comes in handy and water eventually. So, uh, just if you're wondering, what a morning. So, second interval of the day done, you can check it out on my Strava. I've got a couple of sprints on this flat section ahead of me, going back to the hotel, and I need to give the bike back to the mechanics in less than half an hour, so I better, I better get there really, really fast. And then it's kind of a chill day, so a little bit more intensity, short today, about three hours on the bike um, but I'll probably do extensive stretching probably be a bit of a core session and uh, enjoy the rest of the day because it's a beaut, beaut of a day and I want to check out the sea because we haven't had opportunities with meetings and doctor analysis, testing, sponsorship, uh, meetings, all of those type of things the usual so let's get this couple of sprints done and uh, finish up this vlog. <laughs> Is 
amazes me how they manage to build these bridges but then again I'm not an engineer so Okay, so this is actually one of the weirdest roundabout stuff I've ever seen. Here goes a road. There goes a road. This is a stop. Cars come down here. Cars go around there. And there. And around there. That's pretty weird. funny how the sizes are quite different because uh, oh yeah, anyway I skipped the whole chapter uh, we're leaving the bags here because we're staying another night in the hotel but we are leaving for Mallorca tomorrow so all your bags have to go on there and I really hate that because you always go to bed and then you've already packed that into your um, then you've already packed that into your big bag and you only have your small bag with you so I guess you know what I mean I'm looking at the guy behind you. <laughs> One day it will be us. <laughs> we are on our way to go have a coffee next to the beach. It's our final day here. And uh, enjoying the sun. Enjoying the sun. <laughs> 